Hello there, my name is Rampant Mystic, and welcome back to Slay the Spire. And today we are actually not going to be doing Ascension. Today we're going to be doing a daily, just because I just wanted to relax today and have some fun. It's not like Ascension isn't fun, it's just I do get bored of it kind of easily. So, let's actually go do the daily today. Daily challenge for December the 16th. Characters are silent. Modifiers are heirloom, flight, and deadly events. It is a very high scoring run, so let us begin. Alright. Heirloom is dead branch. Okay. Uh, 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 I should have done Ascension today. <laughs> Uh, for those of you that don't know that are uh, you know, just joining in for this episode, me and Dead Branch have uh, uh, had a falling out kind of a while ago. And from then on, I haven't really liked it. I, I still enjoy it with Corruption. That's entirely true. Uh, but uh, otherwise, not so much. All right, well, we have flight. I don't need to look at anything, so let's just begin. So what does Dead Branch mean? Uh, Dead Branch means that everything that exhausts is going to be a new for me. That's going to be a huge negative. I, I, that probably should have been the other way around, but you know what? It's fine. Still fully defended. You know, neutralize the one that's doing the most damage because you'll get the biggest debuff. All right, well, let's kill this one. Okay. Alright, first fight, very smooth, took no damage. Uh, I could technically run a bullet time. The thing is though, bullet time uh, does not uh, count for cards created after it was played. So, uh, there's that. The other thing I can do is I could just skip here. Yeah. It's more than fine. It's not what I want to run. <laughs> I hope I get what I want to run. I mean, with the silent, generally, I do prefer, you know, just gonna point that out there, poison builds. I mean, I know I said it like that, but I do prefer them, I do like them, they work. In fact, oh, what does Q do? I'm pressing Q by accident and... Ah, uh, that was a misclick. I thought that E would play the other card, which was kind of stupid. Well, it doesn't matter, it's one damage only, so. Handicap, yep. That would have been a second poison stab. Oh no, wait. We don't pick up duplicates here. Now, infinite blades. I could do a shiv thing. Shiv is not bad, I suppose, if I can pick up an accuracy or two. Sure, let's try. <laughs> let's try do a shiv thing. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll transform into a distraction. Oh boy. That, that exhausts, by the way. Just saying. Right, that needed to be played. Oh, yeah, I could have attacked. Uh, probably should have. Oh. I failed to realize that the shivs... Uh, uh, you know, the, the, the shivs are... Uh, oh, boy. I'm an idiot. I mean, sure, I have a thousand cuts. That is not a good idea, is it? <laughs> It's not going to fully defend me, there's no point in playing it. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> oh no, this is going to be a mess in a couple of seconds. Yeah, I might as well use setup. Sure, no, it's fine. The enemy's probably dead anyway. Alright, so the stupidest thing I could have done here is... After I said I'm not going to pick up any exhaust cards, pick up shivs. You know, consider that it's a good idea to pick up shivs. Which was a horrible idea. Well, it's too late now. I'm gonna roll with it. But I probably shouldn't have. P probably. Now that I think about it, I definitely shouldn't have. Oh, uh, sure. You know what? I'm willing to play that. There, there's an escape plan, sure. A nightmare. Would you look at that? Uh, yeah. I'm gonna take a bunch of damage here. I was really hoping for a thousand cuts again, to be honest. Because it's good AoE. It's really, really good AoE. Ah. Well, I mean, I'm definitely double playing these, and I guess I'll poison the back one. So 
Sorry for uh, being very silent there. Uh, pun sort of intended, I suppose. Uh, but, oh no, this is going to be a mess. I guess I could try embracing the whole thing, but uh, unlikely. Quick slash, sure. It's actually fine. Uh, sorry for being uh, too silent there, but the problem is I have sneezing for issues again. And uh, first do this, then do this. Deflect just in case. Do that, do that, and kill. Nope, wrong target. Wrong target. Well, there's a backstab. And a bullet time. Alright, Tiny Chest is a really good pick up here. Swift Potion. Ah, uh, boy. <laughs> Ah, I shouldn't have done today's... Uh, it's confusing my... Should I embrace it? Should I go, like, straight up just everything that... Ex you know what? Today's fun day. Let's... I'll pick up every single card that has exhaust on it, and we'll see what happens. Yeah, why not? Sure, poison. Whatever. Keep going. Every card that exhausts, I'm gonna be picking up from now on forward. Going forward, that is. Hmm... This is going to be a mess by the end of this. By if, uh, if I even get to the end of the run, that is, just saying. It is uh, entirely possible that we don't really survive too often. Too long, sorry. Yeah, sorry about this. It seems like I'm fine, even though I do, you know, I do take pills uh, for this. Uh, they do help, by the way. Trust me, it's otherwise it's a lot worse. Uh, but I do. Ooh, strike dummy, cool. Uh, you know, what? I'm, I'm willing to take a predator here because of the extra draw. Plus, it's a high damage card, so I do take pills for this. And oh, it's a good opener. Can I get a better one? Unless I get an infinite blaze here, it's sort of pointless. Okay, well, whatever. Uh, it's very worse. It's a lot worse than the was when I don't take a pill. But the problem that I'm willing to take this 18 just to deal a little bit more, I guess. It probably shouldn't. I probably am dead here. Did I just concede the whole thing? Dagger throw? Mm, maybe. Maybe. Sure. But the problem I have is that, you know, I take the pill, you know, like half an hour passes until I'm like fully well. And uh, then what happens is, you know, everything stops. I'm like, you know, I'm, I'm more than fine. I started recording and I uh, totally, you know, after I started recording, two minutes in, I start sneezing like a madman. Dagger spray. None of these exhausts, so dagger spray. It's a must-have. Blue candle! Yeah! This means I can take a bunch of curses, and I probably should, actually. Well, let's rest. It doesn't matter if I can upgrade anything at this point. Now, I don't really want to take these two elites. I can pro How many did I do? Two only? I do need to shop. I guess I can go for this one, but this elite, this rest? Yeah, you know what? That's fine. Eh, sure. Those are, those are fine. Crippling Cloud definitely removes all the artifacting. Now, do I want to use distraction? That's the real question here. You know what? Yeah, it's a good thing I did. I'm going to remove a balance of... Nope, keep that. When I said a balance, I meant more aggressive cards. Eh, I didn't need to keep all of them, I suppose. Poison. Sure, neutralize. I guess this one is the first to die. This one's the last to die, so... And let's defend. You know, that crippling cloud, really good. Double weakness on all the enemies. And cleared the artifact. Let's not forget that. This means I don't really to really worry about my health too much. Huh. Predator. Not on. No wrong target. That was really stupid of me. Okay. Well, let's just kill this target. I, I just wanted him to die at this point. That's a lot of daisies in my deck. There's a lot of daisies in my deck. Almost. Now, oh. a piercing wall is actually going to be good next round. 
Sure, let's use it. Ooh, the agony is endless. And masterful stab. Good thing it doesn't count as me being attacked. Please tell me there's not a Hexagos fight. I did say I'm taking every single... Yeah, it's a Hexagos fight. Every single... Uh, yeah, sure, I'm willing to do this. And I'm willing to take the injury as well. Uh, let's rest. No, oh, I didn't need to rest. What am I doing? That's stupid. That was really stupid. Why did I do that? Uh, oh, well, whatever. Might as well full heal now, right? <laughs> Alright, shuffling our deck is not really going to happen too often. Preserved Insect, on the other hand, is really good. Uh, Lee's Waffle, normally I would take this. At this point, though, just because it's the Hexagos fight, I, I, don't, I don't think I want to take it. Fairy in a bottle, just in case. It's too expensive, I should save my money. Yeah, and we're not going to be removing cards, because why not? Dagger Spray, right? I mean, Dagger Spray or Neutralize? Probably Dagger Spray. I should upgrade Infinite Blades, but at this point, I don't really care. Yeah, let's uh, take one HP damage. <laughs> oh, there's Infinite Blades. If somebody was... Now, if this isn't Venom, I'm going to be mad. Noxious Fumes. I do have a Catalyst, so why not? You know, I'll do it. Plus, I have like a Poison Stab or whatever. Sometimes. Ooh, this is going to be interesting next turn. Not this one. Oh! I mean, there's no way I'm defending for this much because I'm on full health. Because somebody actually rested. Yeah. But, at the very least this way, I do sort of nerf the enemy. Again, there was no way I was defending for that much. If I was on low health and didn't actually pick up Pentagraph, sure. No. Oh, are you kidding? Let's see what this gives me. Maybe... Well, oh, too bad. No chemical axe. Mm -hmm. Sneaky strike. Yeah, of course I'll play it. Of course I'll draw an extra card. Are you kidding? Especially if it's free. Oh. If only I had gotten that a while ago. Accuracy. Too late. Now, because we're running a very, very interesting deck... Uh, this means I can't really rely on it. Now, what that means is that I can't rely that in the next hand or when the deck does shuffle back around, I'm gonna get a specific item. Thus meaning I cannot wait for anything specific to come back around. Because my deck is gonna get keep getting fuller and fuller. It's not gonna keep getting smaller and smaller, which is normally what happens. Ah, yeah, sure, let's, let's do it. There's an accuracy, there's another blade dance. There's a catalyst. Uh well, I, I wanted to play one. Like just out of that, I got so many cards. Ah, more blade dance, sure. Uh, ah, more blade dance. Well, let's reflex here. Predator? Yeah, it's enough. Hey, that was it. First floor boss defeated. No Beyond Perfect. Uh, I conceded that by resting, because I'm an idiot. It does happen. I'm sorry, I'm just taking off my... My jacket. No, it's not really a jacket. It's like a hoodie. It is an actual hoodie, so... Uh, I will not pick up any rare cards if I can help it, though. We still do want to maintain, you know, at least some score. I'm willing to take Calling Bell, even though Slaver's Caller is just the way to go. I'm sorry, this is like... A really good item. I did want Calling Bell there. Calling Bell's good. After it was changed, it's just insane. Unless you have Dulu Doll. In that case, it's ugh. Doesn't matter where we start, let's just start. Actually, Dulu Doll. Speaking of Dulu Doll, yeah. Let's say. Dulu Doll would be nice as well. Alright, let me uh, fully defend for, I suppose, a couple hundred turns. Even though the enemy is not attacking next turn. Infinite Blades, Predator, yeah, that's it. Now, if I can actually pick up an Accuracy, I will. Even though I did say I can't rely on my deck, I can still probably play an Accuracy from time to time. So, let's shiv first. I should probably do the Exhaust first, because, you know, I can get interesting cards. Am I striking or am I distracting? Strike. Yeah. As you can see, I'm not dealing a lot of damage, though. Again, uh, Duo Doll would be really, really... Really nice here. That is a lot of damage. 
Wraith form again? Why did I do that? I could have... Oh, whatever. Oh, one low. That's 14 damage right there. And the enemy is... No, not dead. Hmm. And I cannot kill, surprisingly. Can't kill because I'm weakened. Hmm. Well, I'll remove that. And I guess I'll play the blur, sure. Why not? Taking more damage. Oh, there's a backstab. You're not dead yet! Are you kidding me? Liquid memories, sure, that'll be useful, I guess. Now, acrobatics could help, and you know what? I'm gonna pick one up. Upgrade a card! Sure. Uh, you know what? Infinite Blades. Why not? I'll just be able to play it at the start of the turn. Now, what is the latest shop I can go to? I can probably go to this one as well, but I do want to check out this one. I do have enough money, I just realized that. So, Gidea, yeah, uh, definitely must have. So, we're going to be prioritizing a bunch of rest. Molten Egg. It's just going to affect cards that are added when I add them. It's still a good pickup, though. Definitely not picking up Dolly's Mirror. I mean, I really want it to affect cards that are generated in fight, but it doesn't. All right, there is the Deadly Events triggering at the very least, you know. We we're gonna have Giddy. I was hoping for Duvo Doll to be honest, but oh, this happened, of course. That's fine, that's fine. Sh sort of fine. Mm -hmm. This thing is gonna be dead sooner or later. Like right now. You know what? Double in Venom. Yeah, let's go. Now, where's all my Dagger Sprays at? Dagger Sprays at. Dagger Sprays at. Am I willing to do this? <laughs> of course I am. Are you kidding? Pen nib? Pen nib? Pen nib? Do I have a... I do have a pen nib. I saw the animation on my, on my silent. When did I pick up the pen nib? Of course I'm gonna use it. Are you kidding? Give me a good attack. You know what? I can't complain about these attacks. Those were good attacks. And good support. Centennial puzzle and... Blade Dance, of course. Smoke Bomb? Yeah. I don't know why I didn't pick it up. Alright, so I do need to go to a couple of rests. Uh, getting Giria up to three is a, a really, really good thing. Now, that being said, I sh should go to these two, right? Yeah. So, I'm going for this late. And probably these three rests. I don't know. We'll see. For now, though, I'm going to go for this late. Oh, Blade Dance. Oh, Infinite Blades. Ah, Cloak and Dagger. That's gonna exhaust. Oh, right. That's gonna happen. Totally forgot about that. I really don't want to neutralize the back one, but I don't really have much of a choice. You know, it's just better if it's dead than if it's there. And, of course, a lot of health being taken from me. <laughs> Saying that's not fair. Oh, pen nib. Pen nib. Pen nib. Alright, that's something I'm not using. That is 30. just straight up dead. Just straight up kill. And yeah, block. I'd rather not take the full extent of the damage here. And that was a bad idea. I could have killed there easily. Mall bank. Uh, okay, so I'm not going to the shop here. That settles that. Uh, dagger throw is really good. Deflect. I do need some sort of defense. Uh, definitely going for the rest here. What's left? Lift. We do not want to be asked if we lift, okay? Art of War? Sure. Alright, so I'm definitely going to <laughs> this elite. I'm not I'm gonna skip one elite, okay? Uh rest here. Just get some health up. What is the boss fight? Ooh geez. I could go to the shop, but I don't want to. Oh no. Where's my dagger spray at? Where's my dagger spray at? Where is it? No! No, that's not fair. Well, they're all weakened. Ah, oh, hmm. the game hates me. If only I had a free bullet time that I can call upon whenever I want to. <laughs> yeah, if only. Uh, yes, I am using Catalyst here. So you're the one buffing. You're the one that's gonna die first. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Mm hmm. 
Well, I guess I'm taking 9. I just did not notice that this enemy was attacking with a, a non-multi-hit attack. Which was a mistake on my part. Pennib! Pennib? Our war just triggered, okay. For some reason. Hmm. Sneaky strike. Or a sucker punch. None. Alright. Time for our final lift. I'm basically just going for all the rests. Yeah. And then rust. <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. Let's go for the elite fight. Whatever. Oh, yeah. That's going to be good. How am I going to plan this out? I guess this way. Uh, do I even use Crippling Cloud here? I don't think so. Escape plan, sure, let's see what we draw. Absolutely nothing of interest, so I guess I'm gonna use Dagger Throw. And eh, maybe I should have used uh, Crippling Cloud, I don't know. Why are you attacking me? I definitely should have used Crippling Cloud. Ooh. Do I want to use Storm of Steel here? Maybe, yeah. Why not? Bad nib! Bad nib! Nope. Dagger Spray is a good option for the opening turn. Yes. And I'm going to be at full health, so you know what? Let's, uh... Shivs or... Yeah, you know what? Shivs. Now I just need Shuriken, Kunai, and all that jazz. Alright, Infinite Blades has been played. That's good. Shall I Acrobatics? No. We shall not be. Now, do I recall... Anything. Uh, maybe, actually. Surprisingly. Yeah. Maybe I recall the uh, thing. The dagger spray, to be honest. Yep, I definitely recall the dagger spray now. It's definitely worth it. It's just a guaranteed kill there. Okay, let's, let's play tools of the trade. It's not a bad thing. There is no way I'm perfecting this. I think at this point I have foregone uh, perfecting anything. I should have played a lot of attack there. Oh well. Ah. Uh, discard the uh, injury. Slice. Neutralize. And yeah, Predator. I could have used something. I probably should have. I had the extra energy too. Discard the injury, sure. Uh, Blade Dance, definitely. Give me more accuracy! Oh, that's that's a pen nib. Yep, that's a pen nib. Escape plan into Shiv into Sure. I'm definitely using that. Uh, I'm gonna use a bouncing flask, you know. It's not the most damage I could have dealt, but I might get a bane randomly, which could help me kill, you never know. Plan for failure. That's what I always do. Uh, speaking of which, doppelganger is absolutely not needed. Well, this is gonna be stupid, but I'm gonna do it. Oh, would you look at that? Hmm. Well, the enemy is gonna die from poison, which is uh, surprising, to say the least. So I'm not really gonna eat burst here, and I'm not really gonna eat anything here. Okay, I didn't let it die from poison, but it was going to. And that's what matters. None of these, even though some of them were really good. Velvet Choker, I do sometimes play a lot of cards. Astrolabe? No. Pandora's... No. The reason I didn't take Astrolabe, even though I could have, is because it could give me a rare card. The reason I don't p take Pandora's Box is because I really just like Pandora's Box. That, that really is it. Oh, that was a pendant. I should have checked, I should have checked. I should have. I didn't, I should have. I shall face my consequences. Hmm. Oh, one of them went into the deck, I believe. There's a choke going on here. Ah, neutralize the first one. Now, I do want to actually get some extra damage out. And then do all-out attack. So it's you, 
And I no, maybe I should have actually defended. That was sort of stupid of me. Oh, boy. Let's see, what is this gonna do? Nothing. I'm still gonna take a ton of damage. Uh, where is my first rest? That is kind of far away, to be honest. Yeah, whatever. I'm not skipping the fight, even though I have a smoke bomb. It's probably a stupid idea, uh, but I'm not doing it. Uh, sure, let's use expertise. I need an attack. Thank you. I can't take two. I don't want to take two. I'll take it out maneuver because why not? Uh, okay, we don't really want this. Unless it's the neutral or the regret. You know, the regret is fine. I'm <gasps> no, that makes two neutralized. Oh, I can remove one of them if I need to. Hmm. This one's upgraded, so it's more powerful than mine. Mango! Uh, yes. But where is the final shop I can go to? Okay, that is the one, and I will actually go to it, but I'm going to go to this one as well. Now, I don't need to remove my uh, thing yet. Oh, okay. Clockwork souvenir. What is the boss fight? They don't really apply artifacting, but clock souvenir and flex potion, just saying, is really good. And I'm willing to give away Maw Bang for it, I believe. I'm not gonna really need the Liquid Bronze anymore. Trip it is. Because we all like Trip. Finisher. Yeah. Yeah, sure. And I still have some gold left over for the next uh, shop. Oh, Elite Fight. Would you look at that? Pennib. Consider yourself nibbed on the pen. Alright, there's the footworks. I don't think we've played footworks in a, a little bit, to be honest. Sure, I'll play that. Probably didn't need to. Probably didn't need to. Okay. Okay. Sh sure, you're still not dead. There's a bunch of cards that I'm never going to see again. Ah. Ah. Would you look at that? A dead Reptomancer. And nib for the win. Bottle light. Oh, riddle with holes. Yes. Count me in. Flashettes as well. Really good. Trip definitely in the opening hand. Now I just need to upgrade it. That is the next thing I'm doing. Uh, I was probably going to skip one of these elites anyway. Uh, just, you know, to be honest. I wasn't going to go for all of them because uh, third floor elites without a proper build are difficult. Well, I can finish her. I can pet her. Guess which one I'm going to do. I probably should have finished her. <laughs> Instead of a uh, predator her. Hmm. Oh, see, he's not attacking. I can play a bunch of cards here before I actually do start doing any serious damage. Oh, adrenaline. Uh, I cannot get rid of anything here. I guess I don't need to. Outmaneuver. Adrenaline. I do want to play Riddle of Holes, but 19 damage for it. I can play one more thing before I... It's 25. 21 damage for it! Oh my... That was just 100 damage, straight up. Oh boy. And we're still on 3. Tactician of all things. <laughs> ah. Shift pen nib. Unload. Uh, yes, actually unload does work well here. Because it's going to remove tactician, but... That is about it. I just took my first point of damage in this fight because I didn't draw anything, really. Neutralize. Let's uh, distraction for a little bit. Deadly poison. Predator. And enemy's dead. To poison, of all things. Frozen egg, sure. We're gonna get all the eggs, by the way. Backflip. Uh, or... If that's right, I'm gonna take the backflip. Of course, I'm going to go here. Uh, I don't really have anything else to upgrade, so. Lantern. Yeah, let's go for a question mark. Fight a boss for a rare relic or heal to curse down. I actually do want the curse, but I, I think I prefer the relic, to be honest, because I don't have dude all yet, so I really shouldn't focus on the curse too much. Ooh, masterful stick. 
That was the pendant masterful stab as well. It's endless agony. I have not discarded anything yet. Yet. I'm gonna discard one of the distractions. That was one discard. That's two discards, but there's no point in it. Unless I really want to draw, but I have one. Yeah, I have enough uh, cards to play here. And of course I'm gonna play. That is a lot of damage. I mean, if you can lower its value, like its cost, sure. That is a lot of damage. Uh, if I can kill here, that'd be really nice. Uh, I don't really need Terra here. Terror was not going to help there, by the way. Just just pointing that out. Terror here was not going to help. I just got real lucky with uh, not getting a bunch of attack cards. Come on. There it is. You know what? It's still probably worth it. Tungsten Rod, maybe. I did actually get Finisher, so I don't need a second one. Okay, our final shop. No, 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 I don't want to pick that up. I almost picked it up. Alright, so a Duno and Dekka fight. Yeah. So I'm going to go for uh, this lead and probably not that one. We'll see. Hmm. Okay. Well, I have Clockwork Souvenir. I do need, I believe, two more relics. I, I could count, but I don't want to. So I can pick up these two to guarantee myself. Uh, okay, let's count. Three, six, nine, ten. Tw yeah, 23, so I do need two more. Now, I'm definitely fighting at least one more elite, so I don't need to pick up, you know, the cauldron as well. So I'll pick up Blood Vile, and I do really want this. I'm going to take it instead of the Weakness Potion. It's like... I, can't, I, have, a, I have more gold. Is Smoke Bomb more valuable than Fairy in a Bottle? Well, that answers your question. Or at least mine. Yeah. Oh, the pet nib. Uh, too bad I don't have anything hard-hitting hard here. And now we pass the next turn. I just, you know, defend if I can. And of course I can't. Oh, maybe actually. I will draw. Yeah. Nope. No defense today. Sure, that'll do two damage. As wait, I'm gonna be full. Yeah. Overflowing, in fact. Ah. Oh, there's no way for me to buff it, so. Let's just kill. Question card, and. Now, I do weaken the enemy in several different ways, but heal hook. I mean, when am I really gonna play it? To be honest, let's uh, rest. There's no point in upgrading it. I, I know this is like the 10th time I've said that. I did go for double weak, yeah. I rested. Why not? Okay, so Centennial Puzzle is no longer triggered by my curses, which is kind of nice. It used to be. Which was a little bit annoying. Oh, the pen nib. Alright, this is where I want to play Predator. That is almost overkill. Oh, that is almost overkill and it's too bad because that is going to be short of overkill if i do this this is probably the stupidest thing i'm ever going to do because i'm saving this for the dono and deca fight it's it's not worth it it's it's not worth it. oh that is so much more damage oh it's not worth it that doesn't count as overkill because it needs to be a single number it can't just be a total, uh, some uh, some total of, you know, whatever I just did, from even if it's just one card. Dagger throw? You know, I should definitely use prepared here. I will uh, probably not be using distraction. I don't know. Ah, well, uh, I don't know. There's some leg sweep, I guess. I know it's a wrong ordering, I should have used Lexi before I started attacking, but... One, two... Okay, let's see. So I need to use the shove first because I don't know what I'm gonna get. Okay, that's bad. Neutralize, and I can actually use this. Nope, that's not usable. Yeah, I was hoping for an extra attack, but didn't get one, so... Oh, the enemy's dead. 
oddly smooth stone. There it is. We are above what we need to be. Could pick up piercing well. I won't. Oh, wait, wait. I said I wasn't going to pass up uh, exhaust cards if I can. Of course, still keeping in line with uh, my personal rules. I'm definitely going to be fully healed here, so I guess... Did I remove the second... I did not remove the second neutralize. I was going to, I didn't. <laughs> uh, well, whatever. I guess uh, we've foregone that score modifier now. Alright, let's uh, flex potion. There is my extra strength. Thousand cuts or accuracy. The thing is though, this is AoE, but this I do play a lot of shivs. So, uh, a thousand cuts? At most, a thousand cuts is going to be like... Yeah, I think accuracy is better. And of course, the enemies do have a bunch of artifacting. Which prevents me from basically doing any damage this turn. And that is all I'm willing to play. Yeah, sure, I'll backflip because it's so much, but... Hello. Where are my shivs? There they are. The beautiful shivs. Ah, malaise, would you look at that? How dead are you? No, seriously, like... I should have waited for the pendant. I did... I checked, like, right now. That is not enough damage. Which is horrible. I still is it worth that? Is it worth taking like twenty six damage in order to deal like sixty for to one enemy? Probably not. Escape plan. Escape plan. Okay, I'm not taking twenty six. I got really lucky there. I n normally wouldn't do that. I wouldn't risk so much. Yes, yes. Remove, remove. Oh, tungsten rod negates the whole curse removal damage. That is really awesome. Ah, would you look at that, a skewer. More shivs, of course. The reason I'm not using die, 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 I don't know. Probably should have. Too light for you. Too light for you, my friend. Okay, and I sort of figure we're more or less done here. Pendib, oh, there's a terror, it's too late though, I played the crippling cloud. Pennib on Skewer, of course. There it is, and that is today's daily complete. Now, score-wise, horrible. If I'm above 100, uh, 1,100, I would be extremely surprised that is honest. Because I did not get any perfects whatsoever. I got, like, maybe two champions? I made the mistake of picking up a second neutralize and not removing the first one I had. I didn't get the curses modifier. I, at, th at least I didn't pick up any rares, you know, at least there's that. <laughs> but that is about it. That is about the extent of it. And so basically the scores we're going to have, I didn't even have overkill, uh, barely in the timer. Honestly, I'm rethinking it. Maybe not even above a thousand. So let's see, score wise. What? How? That's not possible. Okay, so light speed, Highlander. Oh, I like shiny, but it's still only like 50 points. Money, money. Oh, money, money. I didn't realize about that, to be honest. I totally forgot about that one. Uh, Popper, of course, well fed. Yeah, have zero rare cards. Yeah, well fed. Highlander, wait. <gasps> what? I just realized that we... What? Of course neutralize the starter card. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well... You know, I did say I was going to be really surprised, and I was technically correct, because I was assuming I wouldn't have Highlander. Anyway, uh, Champion, of course, two, again, I did notice the two. Maybe I, I thought I maybe I had done a third somewhere, but mm, no. Anyway, score-wise, uh, very low for today's daily, so uh, top six, seven, hundred, maybe? Five. Eh, good-ish. Average-ish. For now, though, my name's Rampa Mystic. I do hope you enjoyed this episode of Slit Aspire, and I do hope to see you all in the next one.